Hi everyone, thanks for stopping by. So today I'm going to show you how I made this vintage looking instrument carrying case uh, that's customizable for any kind of instrument.
Okay, now time to take a break. Is that a waterfall? Is that a waterfall? Yeah. Yeah.
So I really hope you enjoy watching this video on how to, to make a vintage looking case. Uh, as you can see, we have some nice thick upholstery. We've got some corners from the valley and, and hinges and stuff. Uh, so uh, it's, it's a very nice slick looking case, I think. Um, the reason why we went this way was because uh, after I packaged the Mandola for shipping, uh, I always send pictures to my customers so they can see the, the state of the package before it goes out in the mail. And my customer expressed concern about uh, it was in a cardboard box meant for those instruments, but it was just a cardboard box. So this way it's safe in its case. It doesn't fit the cardboard box anymore, so I will have to kind of build like a quick uh, packaging and then uh, it'll be on its way. Uh, so this is it for this case. Um, Mandola case are very, very hard to come by because we did look online before we decided to go with uh, this case. And then I already had a case made for mandolin, which I show pictures to my customer. And, and that's why we went with, with uh, that model. So um, if you have an F5 or an H5 mandola, and we would be willing to have a case like that. You can leave me a contact with the contact form at the bottom. Uh, I can make the same with an F5 and an H5. And F5 case are easy to find, H5 not so much. So, uh, so now they're available here at Hovington Instruments. So once again, I want to thank you all for stopping by and watching. Don't forget to like and leave the thumbs up and, and uh, share the video. And don't forget to subscribe up here. And until next time, I wish you well.